Hey everyone, it's a Crafter Crusher back for another video. Um, <clears throat> this is going to be a video about my um, crochet or my project bags that um that I made. Um, I have a stack here. I do have to tell you, they're all drawstring. I have. Well, I have one that is not in here because it is not finished. It needs its, um, it needs its ribbon or whatever I'm going to use for the drawstring. It's over there somewhere and I'm not really sure where it's at. Um, so I have <clears throat> three that are complete, they're sewed. And I found some, several in my, in my room that... I had, um, glued a while ago, and they're not the best, but the glue has held up really well. Um, they do have pockets on the front of them, because when I was using them myself, they're sacks, they're not box bottoms. I am printing a pattern off right now, so if you hear that, I apologize. Um... But I am selling them. I am selling the bags for $20. Plus $10 for shipping. So it'll be $30 total, I guess. Because I want to make sure that um, the shipping is cost. And yes, I'm kind of rocking and swaying. I want to make sure the shipping is, you know... <clears throat> um, you know... I don't think the shipping will be over $10. And if the shipping is under $10, there is no refunds because I do not know how to do refunds. So, um, I'm going to show you them. Um, like I said, three of them are sewed and the rest are glued. The three of them that are sewed is box bottoms and the other two is are all glued in their sacks so um I don't know how many I have let me see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten I have eleven of them plus I have one over there that still needs its drawstring so, um, let's get started. So I have the Beauty and the Beast print on this side. And then on this side, I have this pretty, um, purple color. And on the inside, why did I get blurry? Come back, there we go. And on the inside, I have like a lilac -y purple. And the drawstring is a lilac purple. These ones do not have pockets because I haven't really quite figured that out yet. But it is boxed, but it is a box bottom. So I do have that one. <clears throat> also, I did post them on Instagram and I posted them on my Facebook group. Or my shop. It's my it's Elizabeth's Crochet Shop. Um, if you're interested, I will link it below. Um, I have this one here. And it's a really... Sorry, kid. You might hear my kid snoring. So, be prepared. It's this really pretty orange fabric with flou white flowers on it. And this one does have a pocket... What I would do was I would just cut a piece of paper out, write my project name, um, the hook I was using, and what yarn I was using, and where the pattern came from, and then that was beaten. That was right when I started doing videos. So it does have a pocket on it, and they <coughs> do cinch up. It's a good size bag. Now these have been in my in my or 
and then on the on the inside is just white. So, so I have this one. And then I have this pretty one. That one has a yellow draw or a yellow string. Then I have this one. They are wrinkled a little bit because I had them folded up nicely and I wasn't using them. And I figured I would come on here and try to sell them. They are in really good condition. It's just I don't I don't use them. So I would I figured I would try to Kind of rubber band in this one. This one is a pretty, another pretty floral fabric. Kind of like a checkered one with both flowers. This one does not have a pocket on it. It has a yellow drawstring. So I have that one. I have an owl one. And this one does have a pocket. It's this animal fabric and in the inside is like a gray polka dot one and it has a green a neon green string this one um, has a yellow pocket because I ran out of the other stuff and this pockets kind of small Um, but it's the heart fabric, and like I said, they are wrinkly because, um, I had them all setting up nice. So before, I'm afraid to iron them because I use glue on most of these, and this one has a purple drawstring to match the purple flower, or purple hearts in it. So there's that one. Like I said, they're not the greatest, but it could be great for a beginner that's just learning to crochet. This is, I don't remember what, I don't know what this print is. Paisley, maybe? Is that what this is called? Um, it has a pocket on it because I was using up scraps for <clears throat> myself. And it has a pink um, drawstring. But there's that one. And then I have this one here. Which is, um, which it has a pocket on it. It is like the blue camo, um, one with trees and leaves and stuff. But it's I need to fix this here and I will before I sell it. I have some of that glue here somewhere. I just don't know where. But I have this one and it has a navy um drawstring to it. Um this one is a box bottom. It is sewed and it has hearts on this side and the purple on this side. And then in the inside, it has um, a light pink. And this one's kind of thick at the top, which I do not like this bag because I did, um, I was trying to do something different, which I sewed two at the top and I don't like that it is a box bottom so I have that one I'm not sure how I'm going to um, package these if anybody does want one um, so if you um, make and sell bags can you give me some pointers as to how you do it how you make or ship them and this one has a pocket and is like a forest print. It has birds and foxes and owls and squirrels. 
and trees. And I think that's pretty much it. <laughs> but I have that one, and it has like a turquoise um, string to it. And then I have another owl one. It has a pocket. So this is this owl one. I'm really showing you the crinkly side anyway. And it has a pocket. And it has a pink string. And my last one was the very, very first bag I ever sewed. <clears throat> it has um, paw prints on one side. And it only has um, the outer layer. So it has paw prints on one and plain black on the other. And it is box to bottom also. <clears throat> I got heartburn now. So, that is all my bags. Like I said, I have them um, for sale in my shop. Um, it's on Facebook, not Etsy or anywhere. I would love to do Etsy, but I am on Social Security, and I don't want to mess that up. As you can tell, I'm still sick. Um, I have the cough and the runny nose and the congestion up here. But other than that, I feel pretty good. It's just, it seems like the cough and the ch chest con or the face congestion is, and the stuffiness is the last thing to go. Um, but I will leave my, um, <coughs> I will leave the link to my, um, Facebook shop on here in the, in the description, description box. And if you would like a bag, please um, <clears throat> message me on Facebook Messenger. I'll also leave my channel email down below. So if you would like to purchase a bag from me that way, you can do it that way. Also, you, um, if you do order a bag, um, you pay me through PayPal, and I will give that link to you whenever you, um, buy the bag. So, no pressure, you don't have to buy any, any, anything from me. I just got finished doing, um, 12 crochet stitch marker, or 12 stitch marker orders. Um, so they will be going out in the mail tomorrow. It is 1.27 a.m. on the 4th of Janu February. It's February now, not January. So I am going to let you guys go. I hope you have a great Tuesday. And I will talk to you guys hopefully this weekend. Bye.